like one step forward, one step back. Good morning! Um, it is 20 to 8 here in Sicily. We're on the way down to a bus station. Today we're going up Mount Etna. Europe's most active volcano, Europe's highest volcano. Just walking, oh shit. So yeah, gonna get a, a bus, I think it's about an hour and a half to the base of the mountain. Gonna get a cable car up to 2,000 meters. We're gonna get out and we're gonna walk the rest. There's a few options once you get out, you can either A, go in a guided minibus tour, takes you up to the top or B you walk and we are walking so there's the central station over there you have to come across the road to these AST buses here bus is 6 euro 50 only one leaves per day at 8 15 so 6 50 return which is really good just having a nice little El Cafe the breakfast of champions! <laughs> so as with all public transport in Italy, you have to wear face masks. I think we have about two hours on this bus. See loads of empty seats. So um, we used to stop for a quick break, get some water in this um, village called Nic Nicolassi. That's the shop there. Galatia. Two bottles of water. Dan didn't get off the bus. Oh, what well, a priest. Rosemary's Pub. So the bus has just dropped us off at the top here now. Well, not at the top. Etna. So this is the funicular up here. Cable cars takes us to 2,000 meters. Got the ticket for the cable car, 30 euros return. Cafe in the Venucular station at the top. Gonna get a hot dog and a coffee. Still wearing the mask.
So we're not actually going to go to Mount Etna itself, we're going to go to some of the smaller craters around Mount Etna. Mount Etna is 3,350 metres high, but it's um, prohibited to walk around the top crater. I think it's because it's so dangerous, so you have to get guided tours or a guide to take you. So um, yeah, we're at about 2,500 metres now. We've just been up there, a little viewpoint. I'm going to walk up this dirty track. These are ski lifts, so in the winter you've got ski slopes here, all the snow. I'm out of breath because I'm, un I'm unfit. I'm wearing a hoodie because it's cold. So they're the trucks you can get on this 24 euros round trip, 4x4 to, a, to the top. Quite tough terrain here, very loose gravel, out of breath as you can tell, I'm sweating. When we got to the Fanucla station, one woman was shouting, you need coat, you need coat! Seven degrees, seven degrees, you need coat! Dan was like, sorry, we're from the UK, we don't need no coat. And we were right. We need to go up there now, but look how steep that is. A group three quarters of the way, but almost crawling. So we're just a bit off. Uh, top crate up there and these little crevices you put your hand on it and you can feel the heat coming off it just so hot down these cracks bit of smoke there stop for rest As soon as you put your foot down, the other foot just goes back. It's like one step forward, one step back. What a climb to get up here. Kratari Babagalo, which is uh, just under 3,000 meters. Uh, this is the highest point you could go before needing a guided tour to take you over 3,000 meters. At the top, it was also pretty cold, so we didn't hang around. So, this is us coming down the other side now. <laughs> And that is the volcanoes, Mount Etna's craters, so obviously we couldn't go to the top of Mount Etna because you need a guided tour to get around the top crater, so we were just going down 
and around some of the smaller ones. So back at the funicular station now, the cable cars. Gonna go back down to the first stop, have a, a beer, I think. But yeah, wrong choice of shoes by me today. Going up that steep scree section or dusty section was really hard work. Then don't know if you see the view. So the Funibia, Funicula cable cars take about 10, 15 minutes to get from the bottom to the top. Pizza again on the foothills of Mount Etna, baby. Good shit. Well, I've just tried to <laughs> start again. I've just tried to take the drone up here at the bottom of the mountain. And I've just found out that the SD card is not in the drone. The SD card is at home in Wales. I feel like such an idiot. So tomorrow or the day after, we are gonna hunt for an SD card. So at the bottom of the mountain, there is uh, gift shops. I'll be honest with you, they're all the same. Magnets, t-shirts, gifts. Souvenirs. We're just waiting for that bus back. So the bus we got on was six euro fifty. Um, you leave at quarter past eight in the morning, and um, the only bus back is at four p.m. Although we think it might be four thirty p.m. now. They tell you four just so you get back in time. Managed to find the uh, electronic store that sells SD cards in Catania, so I should be able to pick one up now for my drone. So we've just been dropped off in Catania city centre now. Gonna head to the hostel, freshen up, and uh, yeah, hope you enjoyed Mount Etna. See you later. Yeah.